have another Dollar Tree haul for you today. Don't judge me. If you guys watch my videos, you know what I'm talking about. I literally said I was going to start going to Dollar Tree maybe just monthly instead of before where I was going weekly. And I did just post a bunch of Dollar Tree hauls because of Easter. But I have a baby shower coming up and one of my favorite Dollar Tree YouTubers, I've mentioned her before, Crafty Girl, showed some amazing baby items at her Dollar Tree and I was really hoping I would score and I did. I'm going to save that for last. I will make, I'm thinking about making a basket. You guys know I love doing gift baskets for this baby shower. So when I do that with all the gifts, I will film it. Let me know if that interests you guys, right? Obviously, it's not, I'm not going to just give her the Dollar Tree items. I'm going to get some things off her registry and make a whole little gift basket. But this is just a perfect example how Dollar Tree items to fill up the little gift basket is perfect. So let me just start with the things before the baby items. Because, of course, I can never just go into one aisle when I walk into Dollar Tree. I scored. To me, I really scored. I've never really seen this at Dollar Tree before. You guys let me know. Maybe now because it's spring. I didn't really go to Dollar Tree last spring. I mean, because of quarantine. I did go a lot. Because I, w I literally tell you guys all the time how it's an essential store. But I probably didn't really start going out until mid to late May, early June. Just because things were still scary in April. Um, and obviously it's April right now. So maybe this is more of a April thing when spring first hits Dollar Tree releases. Dollar Tree always has bubbles, but it's always like the really tiny bubbles and you get like a three pack for a dollar. You get way more ounces this way for your dollar and it's a lot better. We do this for the uh, at recess with the kids. We used to blow bubbles for them. Obviously now we have to wear a mask so we can't. Um, so they will blow it for themselves. Um, and the kids love to chase and pop the bubbles. So the little ones suck because they literally get one bubble out of it. They're going boop and then they have to keep blowing and blowing and blowing. So these are perfect because you get lots of bubbles. And you can see there's multiple bubbles that are going to come out at a time because of the wand. There's only what, two, four, six, seven bubbles in different sizes. You get a, two big bubbles, four little bubbles. So this is 32 ounces. I'm not 100% sure how much the little ones are. Maybe 8, 16. I want to say 8 ounces each. So with that, you would only get 22. But anyway, yes, it's still better for this just because the bigger wand and the style of wand. But I will say, if I had noticed better... Oh, wait, are these all... Some of them, the wands are different. So like if you look at this one, there's only two bubbles. Same thing with this purple one. You only get two bubbles. Where this one, you get all the bubbles again, just like the green one. So if you guys want to get this at your Dollar Tree for your kids, your nieces, nephews, grandkids, students, if you're a teacher like me, I'm not a teacher, but I work at a school, you know what I'm trying to say. Definitely check these out. But if you want to get something with um, multiple bubbles at a time with the, you know, the different style wand, definitely look inside to see what you're getting. Oh, now that I look, it's in there. Originally, I was looking down here and see how this one only has like one, but it must have got put in the wrong way because now all the bubbles are up here. So it's weird how that was packed, but whatever. So my kids will absolutely love that. So I picked up four while I was there. I will say I did go to one far away. Sometimes it is really worth going to Dollar Trees that are not in your area. Um... I had a really down Saturday. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I always post and I'm very real, just like I'm real on here. You know, today's my bed's made and I'm dressed. But you know, guys know there's been plenty of days where my bed's been on me and I've been in pajamas. Um, today's Saturday and I was cleaning my apartment with my boyfriend and I was just having a really down day. The anniversary of a friend's death is coming up and COVID just doesn't seem to be going away. Um, it's a lot of things. I don't want to really get into it. If you guys want to talk about it, definitely comment down below. It would be good to know I'm not the only one who's struggling here. But um, my boyfriend wanted to cheer me up. And he's like, oh, let's go to Cold State Park. Cold State Park is a huge park in Rhode Island. I live in Massachusetts, but I live right where it borders Rhode Island. So we picked up Subway. And we did a little picnic. He just wanted to cheer me up. So we actually went to a Dollar Tree in Bristol, Rhode Island. And the crafter section was huge. I actually didn't get anything. Um, I'm really trying to limit. I walked in that aisle and I was like, wow, look at everything. They have so much stuff that my Dollar Tree does not have. But I just, I couldn't condone buying it because I just don't have room for everything. My, I haven't, I'm sitting in an ottoman right now. If you guys haven't noticed, like my chair doesn't have a back. It's because I'm on an ottoman. And I, I'll use the ottoman for craft storage. And the ottoman is officially full. So I will not allow myself to buy any more craft items. Unless it's something very specific that I know I'm going to use. Like, 
it just sucks i have a very small apartment that's another reason i've been really down me and my boyfriend are really trying to upgrade find a bigger place you know i want to start trying for kids in the next six months to a year um and it's just been really hard with covid real estate right now it's just crazy if you guys know how that feels definitely comment down below i don't think it's just my state but my state's definitely from what i can see crazy right now so anyway, so you probably won't see any craft items for a while. And it sucked seeing all those items and I couldn't buy it. But I literally went in kind of with like a budget. I was like, okay, $20. And then of course I spent like 40. But you guys know, you've seen hauls where I spent like 100. So I'm doing pretty good. I picked up this. I've been dying for these. I've been seeing them in all the hauls and never in my store. That's why it's worth going farther away. This is supposed to be like a dupe to the um, Romatherapy line at Bath and Body Works. So this one is the Slumber line, which is like kind of like their sleep line. And it is a soothing lavender chamomile body lotion. Like I said, I'm trying to con I'm trying to have more self-control. I literally had the bat salt and the body wash in my basket. And then I said, no. I said, you have too many body washes right now. My, seriously, I have so many shampoos and conditioners. And I am I just don't have storage for that kind of stuff. So I just have to, I have to just stop buying. So I said, nope, just get the lotion. You don't need anything else. So that's all I picked up. But just so you guys know, they do have a whole line. And not just in slumber. They have like an energize and a calming. They have like a basically the same kind of stuff you see in the aromatherapy lab bath and body dollar tree has their own version perfect for little gift baskets if you want to buy like the whole set and then of course i had to check out the beauty aisle so i've been dying for foot masks just because you know summer season is upon us i will be wearing sandals and flip-flops and stuff soon so i've always wanted hair uh, foot masks but i never see them in my stores but i see them in whole so i knew they existed so i finally caught them so i got one dollar tree brand because um spa april bath and shower is a dollar tree brand and this one just says ultra moisture ultra moisturizing nourishing and soothing softening and it's obviously one pair and it kind of just looks like a sock you just kind of ball up the excess and tie it up so i got that one and then i got two by global beauty i grabbed an exfoliating one it says it will help peel away the calluses and dead skin cells soften cracked heels and rough dry feet convenient wearable mask socks so i grabbed that one and this one is moisturizing so it says this one softens cracked heels and rough dry feet moisturizes and exfoliate same thing convenient wearable mask sock so i can't wait to try those out and then um I grabbed a lighter. I just like to light my candles with this at night. I'm not a big fan of matches or anything like that because I feel like I will uh, end up burning my fingers. So I like just having the long stick. So my fingers are far away from the flame. I tell people all the time I could not be a smoker because I wouldn't even be able to light my own cigarette. Lighters literally scare me. I definitely don't like fire. And then I have a cute little um, glass jar I keep in my bathroom with all my shower fizzies. So when that starts, that I don't have a lot of excess of. I, I don't even have any more backup once that jar is empty and it's a small jar it's not big at all so once that jar is empty that is it so I'm like you know what I'll allow myself to get these because within the next few weeks that jar will be empty and these can refill it so this one is coconut it comes with three and not bad for a dollar at all and this one is lavender and it comes with three as well um the other ones in my jar right now are also from Dollar Tree but they are they're like eucalyptus and they're not this one's April bath and shower that one was not April bath and shower I don't know if it's a Dollar Tree brand or not I think it is. I see it at Dollar Tree all the time. It just, it's definitely not April. Bath Shower with something else. These are name brand bath bombs. I know I just said I can't buy too much, but I do not use bath bombs. These will be in presents. Um, these are, you know, they're smaller. They don't take up too much room. I do have a basket in my walk-in. I kind of label it like a gift basket. And it's just like little quick gifts. If I need to make someone a gift basket, I can kind of throw it in. So I grab these. These are by Onyx Bath House. I've showed before the Mermaid Life one and something goddess i think this one is called sugar sugar and it's strawberries and cream I do have a lot of summer birthdays in my family so i was like you know what i'll just pick up two of those for now and then this too it was a name brand one i could not pass it up it is another bath bomb but this one it says fun color reveal it changes colors within the bomb so it says it goes from blue yellow to green and it has a blueberry blast scent and it just says color your color your bath so it says oh okay so the red and yellow turns orange obviously the red blue turns purple the green blue turns teal so this one is the blue yellow which equals green so you're gonna see like some blue you'll see some yellow and then eventually a bath will turn green so that's kind of cool for me to throw into like a little gift basket 
And then I grabbed myself a little Pond moisturizer. I used to use Pond a lot back in the day. I never really had any complaints, but I started buying more high end only just because I get it through FabFitFun sales for relatively cheap prices. But I saw someone that they do microplaning. If you don't know what microplaning is, it's basically when you shave your face, but with like those very thin blades just to get rid of like the peach fuzz. Um, you know, like I have like a little bit right here, right here. I haven't done a little bit. I got to do that. But, um, and it just helps with smoother serum applications, makeup applications, stuff like that. And I always just did it dry, but I was watching a video of a girl microplaning herself. And I've, I think microplaning is more like the professional term. You can get it professionally done, like at a spa or an esthetician, esthetician, um, I don't think what we do is really microplaning, but it's kind of like the home version of it, I guess. But anyway, instead of her doing it dry, she puts moisturizer on. But she even said, she goes, I don't use my expensive moisturizer because you're literally kind of shaving it off. So she said, I'll just buy like a cheap, like, non high-end brand from like the drugstore and do it because it, it looks so smooth when she did it so i said you know what i think i'm gonna do that so i was gonna pick one up at like target walmart whatever but i saw dollar tree has this and i thought it was perfect because the ones at walmart are like nine dollars but they're like this big they're huge so if you like ponds and moisturizer you're probably better off getting the big one for nine dollars but since i'm only going to be using it for like a little bit of microplaning this small one should last me a very long time and it was only a buck so i grabbed that and then I grabbed a face mask by Bellaro. You guys know I love Bellaro. This was me raining it in so hard. You guys have no idea. They had a whole line with this beautiful packaging. They literally had a facial cleanser, a facial serum, a facial moisturizer, a body mist, um, a bath crystal. They had everything in this so if this interests you guys the chamomile the cucumber the packaging for a gift know that this comes in literally everything would make a perfect gift basket for somebody but since this is just for me i just allowed myself just to get the face mask but honestly if i really love it i could see myself going back and maybe getting some of the other products we shall see i could definitely um let you guys know if you're curious but it's paraben free it's dye free and it says smooth and soften and repair it just sounds amazing and there is one other one when I get to it, I will show you guys. And the same thing, it came in everything. This is like the new spring one. C chamomile cucumber, and there's one more that I'll show you afterwards. And then I grabbed, I was so happy to see these. I've seen so many people hold these and I never saw them in my store. This is a name brand, a salt range. These are Himalayan Pink Salt Lip Balm. I love Himalayan Pink Salt. I actually have another product, it's Himalayan Pink Salt, you guys will see. But, and I love chapstick. So this is like a two-in-one for me. It is cherry and shea butter, soothing and hydrating, rich mix of vital nutrients, all best for you. And I know people swore by this, that it made their lips feel amazing. It literally says it helps relieve, reveal natural skin shine, protects dry lips. It has antioxidants, vitamin Cs. It says how Himalayan pink salt is the purest salt in the world. It contains up to 84 minerals. So this is infused with power-packed beeswax, condition the skin with those antioxidants, with the vitamin E to richly moisturize and soften lips. It says that this lip balm nourishes dry lips while keeping them revitalized and hydrated. So it's just a cute, and it, I find them so cute. Again, perfect for a little gift basket with the next product I'm going to show you. And if you know I got two of it, you know it's because I've been wanting it a really long time. So I got the original and I got the backup. One dollar for a name brand product and you get two of them i would pay a dollar for one so this was absolutely amazing i literally buy generic chapsticks all the time so for a name brand one that was awesome and this is exactly what i was saying if you wanted to do a little gift basket same name brand salt range himalayan pink salt this was the last one i didn't need more bath salts but i said you know what there's only one of it it's a cute name brand may end up even throwing in a gift not keeping it for myself and it's just 100% naturally pure with up to 84 minerals. And it says you will literally experience how fresh and smooth your body feels. And it says it softens and heals cracked skin, reduces swelling, gets rid of dead skin, relaxes the body, cleanses it while eliminating odor. So I allowed myself to get this one. But there were so many. Like I said, there was the one from the aromatherapy line. There was the one with the cucumber and chamomile. And I said, I cannot get all these basalt. So I just let myself get that one. 
which was the name brand one. And then as you cash out, they had a bunch of these at the register and the girl specifically asked you, do you want a hand sanitizer? So my boyfriend's like, why not? So he grabbed the one that, they had different brands. He grabbed the one that says with vitamin E. And then this was also at the register. It is Tic Tac, but it is a limited edition made with Coca-Cola. Literally says right there. And it literally says Coca-Cola on the Tic Tacs. I thought this was amazing. I did already have some. I enjoyed them. All right, so this is a smaller haul because, like I said, I only spent 40 bucks. I have two things here. Oh, I want to show you guys. My mom watches my videos. Okay, mom, if you're watching this right now, get off. I'm going to show your Mother's Day present. You can come back on in, like, one minute. Literally, do not go like this on the screen because it will still show you in a little box. Just, I don't know, hit the 10-second timer, like, 10 times. So I grabbed my mom two wine glasses. She loves stemless wine glasses. They had uh, really cute stuff for Mother's Day. They had coffee cups, wine glasses. She has so many coffee cups, but not a lot of wine glasses. And this one says hashtag super mom. And I love the size of it. I think she will absolutely love this. They had another one that says best mom in the history of forever or something like that. Uh, I just preferred these two more. And then this one says best mom ever with a little heart in the mom. So I got her those two. All right, mom, welcome back. <laughs> all right and then i grabbed this is the other line that is right now so these are the two that you can grab right now at dollar tree with the entire matching set they literally had everything i meant to take a picture and did not get to i was rushing the store I hate sometimes when my boyfriend goes in there with me uh, but he was paying so you know okay so this one says it smoothens, softens and repairs refresh nourish and revive where this one is calm nourish and hydrate so they do do different things and this one is hibiscus rose again paraben free dye free again it came with the bath crystals the facial cleanser the facial moisturizer the body mist the facial oil literally came with everything packaging is on point amazing if you want to do a gift again if i really really end up liking these if i notice a difference in my skin if i love the smell whatever i may end up buying the other products you might see them here or there but i really am trying to do better are just not it's not because of money because they're a dollar just because of storage i'm sold for this place <laughs> i have seen these in people's hauls as well but never saw them in my store so i finally saw it and it's basically just a face shield i was just curious if it would stay on because i have glasses so let's see if not it'll be for my boyfriend so i'm not 100 percent sure how it works carefully take out the face shield from protective plastic bag place the elastic strap around the head okay so it must work even though i wear glasses as long as it stretches out enough yep so obviously i would fix my hair but it works and it's pretty comfortable i would still wear a mask you know obviously as protected um this is going to be more for work if i'm ever in a situation where i really feel like i need the extra protection they do give us goggles because sometimes we do have kids that are spitters uh but i do i cannot wear the goggles they it's a real struggle with my glasses so if i'm ever in a situation with a kid i can pop this on so i will definitely be putting that in my backpack for work all right and then a few more things before i get into the baby stuff so i grabbed two more global beauty care items this is they are both serums um this one i actually have if you guys watch my haul i think I, there was a few for easter it was one of the easter ones it has great stuff for easter baskets i literally have the mask in this from global beauty so now i have the serum as well again perfect for gift baskets it is the multivitamin serum this one has vitamins b c e and niacinamide which people have been obsessed with things that have niacinamide right now they're saying it's so good for the skin the ordinary like blew up thanks to tiktok and everyone's been using a serum with niacinamide from the ordinary Dala has niacinamide and it is a very good brand you can see all of the things it claims um it's ph balance no sls paraben free non comedogenic not tested on animals for all skin types so um you know cruelty free all those good things so i was like for a buck i'm gonna try it and then they also had this one which says rose and ready it has a rose hip and evening prim rose the pack cutting is also really beautiful on this one all the same claims on the side i mean it is the same business and it just says apply two to four drops same brand i meant to say apply two to four drops to palms and gently press serum into face and neck before moisturizes and oils for best results use morning and evening and just so you guys know that it does claim the same things 
under here and below is in like Spanish. So it's the same six dots, really. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Alrighty. So I think. Alright, this is the last thing before the baby stuff. I um probably gonna end up giving one to my boyfriend's mom one to my boyfriend's cousin and keeping one because i know they would really like it and i really like the idea of it so all three all three say give it to god they kind of just have different patterns on them so this one kind of has like a triangle pattern to it this one has like a striped pattern and this one has a floral pattern and they are basically prayer boxes that's even how it's labeled in the back if you look it says prayer box and basically you open them and it has a little it literally says prayer box a little prayer it says blessed is she who believed that the lord would fulfill her his wishes to her luke 145 and it literally comes i thought this was so cute with a mini mechanical pencil and a matching notepad and you literally can just write down your prayers, your wishes, whatever you believe in. Um, even if you're not someone who directly believes in God, you know, whether you believe in the universe or whatever you believe in. I don't question anybody, but, um, you know, you can just write down what you, your goals in life, your aspirations, what you want to manifest in life. So I'm just curious if all the prayers on the inside are the same. Nope. So this one says, be completely humble, gentle, be patient, bearing with one another in love. And say, I think it's so cute that the notepad literally matches. Like, so adorable. And then this one says, The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. So I absolutely love the idea of this. I love jotting things down. So I can definitely see myself, you know, writing what I'm grateful for, what I want in life. Just praise to God. And that's what it's for. Now into the baby stuff. So this is what I will be adding to our gift basket. You guys know I like to do themes and I literally saw all the things that Crafty Girl shared. So I was so happy. So I was able to do like a cute little theme to present. So some of, there is a sesame seed theme going on and then a Mickey Mouse theme going on. And then specifically with Sesame Street, I have a, um, elmo theme and then a cookie monster theme so am i holding on yes okay so this hold on ah! I'm trying to show you guys everything at once it ain't working that way so and they also had big bird but i was just kind of trying to like i said go with a the theme so this is two elmo bottles and um this one says medium flow silicone nipple and it says it's bpa free and complies with fatally regulations if i'm pronouncing that regularly and guys this is not a dollar tree product this is a name brand sesame beginnings and i got the five ounce for when they're smaller and drinking less and then there's a nine ounce when they're drinking more or just drinking water or whatever i'm not too much about babies i haven't had any but so <laughs> and the nipples are tucked inside so and then they have the nice covers so this and then also they had the little comb set to go with it with Elmo. And then they had the teething ring. So I have a whole little Elmo set here. And I could have stopped there, but that's not me, especially when it's only a dollar and they have matching sets. She will be getting all of this. She deserves it. She's a great person. So the next thing is Cookie Monster. And they had three different things in Cookie Monster. So I got the smaller five ounce bottle. They did not have the nine ounce one. So I think this one's really cute too because it's all blue. So it kind of goes. That's the one thing about the Elmo. Like, I don't know if it's just me, but the cover looks pink. But then again, there is pink inside of the Elmo. This one was probably supposed to be more girly, but colors don't really matter. Because I was like, she's having a boy. Um, but Cookie Monster is all blue. And then they had the same teething ring. So I grabbed that. But they also had the rattle. They might have had the rattle in Elmo and it was just sold out. I think this was actually the last rattle in... Um, cookie monster as well so i picked that up so she'll have a little elmo set a little cookie monster set and then mickey mouse i will say that the cover unscrewed which this is already the second time not this exact bottle but just i don't know which bottle unscrewed the first time but um i'll just have to make sure it's nice and tight before i give it to her but this is a Mickey Mouse, and it's by Disney Baby. So, again, name brands. And this one says, Stay Cool. Show you guys right there. And then, again, it has a little nipple tucked on the inside and the red cover. 
And then the other Mickey one that they had has the blue cover and it just says smile. And again, it's Disney baby. And then to go with that theme is they didn't have um, teething rings or um, rattled, but they had pacifiers. So I grabbed the red one and the blue one. They also had one that said the wild one. Uh, it wasn't like Mickey theme. It just said the wild one. Like I said, they had Big Bird. They had Disney princesses if you're having a little girl. Um, and then they had the normal stuff that Dollar Tree carries all the time. Their baby blankets and baby wipes and stuff like that. But this was already definitely enough filler. So now with this, I'll just look at her um, registry. I know there was like a little robe on there, a blanket, some baby hats, some baby socks. I'll just throw that in and make her a little gift basket. Like I said, if you guys are interested, definitely let me know. I can film myself when I make the video. So that is it for this video. If you guys are into hauls, especially Dollar Tree, I do them a lot. Um, and if you're into gift baskets and just gift ideas, I do that a lot. Um, I do unboxings. I don't have as many boxes, but I am filming right after this a Walmart beauty box, an AIA beauty box, and a mystery box. I do buy mystery boxes from companies. Um, and I am going to be filming the organization of my walk-in closet, which I am doing week after next on my spring break. And then once that's organized, I want to start doing try-on hauls because I'm really into fashion. This is actually a new shirt, so you will see that in that try-on haul. This is from Target. I'm a very plus-size person. This is a 4X. I just feel like there's not a lot of women out there representing, like, bigger plus sizes and i would love to do that i think i stop in style at an affordable price this was literally four dollars and i had the cutest sweater with it um i it, i always like my instagram down below like i said so you can follow me there um i do want to start posting like outfits of the day it's just r still cold here in mass i was gonna take a cute picture today um and then but near the water at cold state park was actually freezing we actually stayed in the car the whole time so um but sooner or later i definitely want to do that i just want to have a cute like backdrop and not be freezing my ass off when i do it but if you're into that definitely consider subscribing if you liked the video you like dollar tree you like me any of those things give the video a thumbs up it really helps with the youtube algorithm and comment down below have you guys been seeing the disney baby items the sesame street items um the cool new Bellaro items the salt range items definitely curious i know not every dollar tree is created equal like i said i went all the way to out of state technically even though rhode island's not far from me at all but i technically went out of state for these items but that is it guys be safe